Welcome back, ladies. It's Amber with Creative Journey, bringing you week two, which is our day six through ten. And we are going to get started with day six today. I am so excited that you're still chugging along on this journey to 100 days of praise and positivity. I am going to give you a heads up. I'm going to be using this printable today. Now, if you don't know, I do a printable subscription, and every month you have access to 10 brand new printables that can only be got through the Create in Color website. Um, to get this, you can go to www.colorfulcalling.com. Once you get in there, there's a tab that says Create in Color, and you can subscribe there. It's $9.99 a month, so it equals out to less than a dollar a printable. It's a really good deal, but I'm going to be using one of those today, and we're going to just jump right in. I'm starting off by tracing the word at the very top of our devotion page, which is laugh. I'm going to be using some Tombow dual brush pens, and I'm kind of mixing up my colors. I love the colorful theme of this book. I know you've probably heard me say that a bunch of times, but I've already got my printable um, cut out, and I'm just going to kind of figure out what I want to do for my layout here. I wanted to add a splash of color behind the Bible verse that I'm putting on this page. So I'm using the same colors I used in the word above, and I'm just kind of creating an outline for this to sit on, and then I'm going to glue it down using some Tombow Mono Liquid Glue, the blue cap version. Now, it took me a little bit to figure out what I wanted to use in my layout over here, but I decided on this girl and the little um, caption word fetties in the printable that said, laugh, and then I used every day. My praise God for the day is that I praise God for holding my future in his hands and the fact that I'm able to know he has my very best interest at heart. So ladies, I hope that you know that you are clothed in strength and dignity, just like Proverbs 31, 25 says, and that he has your very best interest at heart. All right, let's go on into our Bibles now. I've got all my printable pieces left over, and I'm going to washi tape off my verse and just start figuring out the layout that I kind of want to use here. Now, as I got into this, I decided I wanted to make the background a lot brighter than just the white. So I ended up pulling out some gelatos by Faber Castell. I don't know. I'm probably butchering that, and that's okay. Um, and I'm just going to add these in, and then I'm going to come in with a baby wipe. This is very similar to what I did with some Distressed Crowns um, last week. And I am going to just create a blending of these colors. So like with the Distressed Crowns, I started out with my lightest color and just began working my way to the brightest color. I hope that as we're going through this, that you understand that the reason I am um, making it go fast is so you don't have to sit there and watch. I know we've got busy mamas, working women. We've got a lot of busyness in our life. And so I don't want to make you have to sit through an hour-long video in real time. Um, I want to be mindful of your time. And if I'm ever going too fast and you have questions, make sure to throw them in the comments below. I watch my comments. I would love to hear from you, even if it's just whatever. I don't care. I would love to hear from you. So comment below. Let me know your thoughts on today's. All right. I'm going to give it a quick dry, glue on a few more pieces. I love this little girl. Um, it's like a friendship, and I like um, I like that. I like the fact that there's two little girls together and the laughter below it. I'm going to add on a few more elements, and then I'm going to get those papers out. And I'm going to be using a Fisker. It is a hexagon punch, probably about... Oh, I would say maybe an inch and a half. And I'm going to start just kind of punching some different colors out to add a little bit of, I don't know, a little addition there at the bottom left-hand side of my page. So I'm going to glue some of those on. And then we are very close to done. Done. 
after cutting off the pieces that are kind of going off my page, I'm going to come in with a Posca pen and I'm going to just create an outline around these. Um, I started using white and it just didn't pop the way I wanted. So I'm going to use a black Posca pen and add that little extra pop of detail. Lastly, I want to add in the date. Now, this date is not going to be the same as yours. I know I'm doing this a little bit ahead of you. Um, so ignore the date if, you know, that's throwing you off because it says February 2nd. Um, but we are finished now. So let's go take a final look at what we've created today. Okay, I want to read this in the NLT, Proverbs 31:25. It says, she is clothed with strength and dignity, and she laughs without fear of the future. I just want to break this down a little bit. Dignity means the state or quality of being worthy of honor or respect. So I feel like we have two takeaways from this verse. Number one, ladies, you are fabulous. You are fabulous in every way. You were designed to be and nothing can take that away. Number two, nothing, seriously, like absolutely nothing can complete you more than God can. So stop worrying about the future and what's to come. Although I understand that's a lot easier for me to say right now than when I'm in the middle of a storm or something's a little bit spinning out of control, but there's nothing to worry about. Be happy, laugh, God has you in the palm of his hand. Ladies, let me know below if you are enjoying this series. Comment below. Go into Facebook and find the Bible group, the Bible journaling group, Bible Journaling and Faith. We will be doing weekly recaps and we're all showing our pages. And it's just a really great place to be if I'm honest. If you don't have Facebook, Find me on Instagram. I am at Created Journey. I want to see your pages. I want to hear from you. I want to know who's watching and going on this journey with me. Ladies, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. It helps the channel to get this series out to other women that do not know what's going on. I love you, ladies, and I will talk to you very soon.